He personally oversaw every step, rushing to complete the renovations before the quality inspection. However, during the factory tour, they discovered a heap of problems. The door paint stuck to their hands, there were flies in the workshop, the fluorescent lights had no covers, and the handwashing stations were not up to standard. Ada assured them he would fix everything immediately, but they said they would go back and discuss it, and would notify him of the result. At this moment, the butler handed him an envelope to deliver to them, but he didn't want to do it. He believed in staying grounded. He addressed all the issues, changing the handwashing stations to foot-operated ones, ensuring the workers wore masks and uniforms and installing lampshades on the lights. The results of the quality inspection came through via fax that day, but the ink ran out just as the results were printed. Quickly, he ran outside and held it up to the sunlight. It said past. Every sacrifice he made was worth it. Two weeks later, on the day of delivery, he splashed some water on his face and watched the workers hurriedly load the goods. He embraced the butler, thanking him for the help he had provided along the way, and expressed his concern that they might fail again and be left with nothing. He set off with the goods, but he arrived at the delivery warehouse one hour late. He pleaded with the receiving clerk for help, explaining that he had finished loading at 5 a.m. The clerk agreed 